Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to create this animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, first one, let's create background layer. Right mouse, new and solid layer. Add name background, click OK. Move to behind of layers and go to FX Presets, search Effect Gradient Ramp. Select this Gradient Ramp, let's use for background layer. And go to Start Color. Let's choose here Blue. Click OK. And go to End Color, let's choose again this Blue. And move to left for Light Blue. Click OK. And go to Ramp Shape, choose here Radial Ramp and click swap colors and hold this point move to center and this point move to down okay and let's lock layer go to layer new and null object and for move to anchor point center hold control double click pen behind icon click tool and move to here select this right and left let's go to solo Okay, link to null object. Select null, also go to solo. And select null, let's move to center. Press S, change scale. And unsolo three layers. And let's see sizes. Okay, and let's change scale like this. And select this layer dead, normal, normal left, and stroke, dead shadow. And these layers, let's link to color main. Select color main, press S, change scale. Okay, and select this null, let's see. Okay, we can change scale a little bit like this. Okay, that's good. We'll change a little bit 160, nice, enough. So, select this layer right, and go to solo and select pen behind icon, move the anchor point, center here like this, and click tool, select left layer, go to solo, let's unsolo right layer, select left layer, and move the anchor point here, let's again go to solo for right, and move the anchor point like this, click tool, and select these both layers, press R, let's see, okay, and let's unsolo layers. Let's go to here and create new rotation keyframes. Go to back and change rotations like this for close this object. Let's see. Okay, so select keyframes, make it easy or click F9 and go to graph editor, make it smooth a little bit. Let's change a little bit. Back to keyframes, select last keyframe, move to right. Okay, and in this time, select these keyframes, move to right, and select layer, null object, and press P. Let's move to up and create new person keyframe. Go to here and move to down. Select keyframes, make it easy. Let's see. Okay, select last keyframe and make it smooth. And select these shift frames. Let's move right. Okay, and right now, let's create new passing shift frame for null object and go to here. Let's move to down and go to back. Hold shift, press R, open rotation, create rotation shift frame, and go to here. Let's change rotation like this. And let's hold these tools like this. Let's see. Okay, select rotation two frames, make it easy. And select work area. Okay, select position two frames, go to graph editor. And let's change graph like this. Okay, not bad. And back to two frames. And right now, select this dead layer, go to solo. And move the anchor point down. Clearization tool and unsolo. And right now, let's select this data layer, press R, 
open rotation, create rotation keyframe, and go to 10 keyframes. Let's change rotation like this and make it easy. Let's select work area. Select let's you frame move to right. Let's select two frames, move to right like this. Okay, and go to here, create new two frame, and go to five two frames, and move to left. Let's see. Okay, not bad. And select this null. Let's go to here. Let's create new position and rotation two frames and go to here and select null. Let's move to here and change rotation like this. Let's see. And select two passing two frames, hold control and left mouse. Okay, and again, let's make it easy. Back to two frames. Okay. And rotation two frames, go to graph editor. Okay, this is good. And here, go to five two frames, create new position and rotation two frames. And go to here and select null object, move to left and change rotation like this. Let's see. Okay, select rotation two frame, move to left. Okay, that's good. And in this time, go to here and create new passing two frame, new rotation two frames, and go to five two frames. And let's move that up like this. And go to five two frames, create new passing two frame, and go to here and move to left. And let's see. Okay, and change rotation. And here, let's create new rotation Q frame. Go to next Q frame and change rotation like this. Okay, again, let's create new position and rotation Q frames. Go to here and move to up and change rotation. So, in this time, select this dead layer, go to edit and split layer or control shift D. And select that two layer, link to null object. Let's see. Okay, nice. Okay, that's good. So select this dead shadow, press T, open opacity. And right now let's create opacity two frame and go to here. Let's change opacity zero and make it easy. Okay, and let's fix some problems. And in this time, select these two position two frames. Let's move to left. Let's see. Okay, and here let's select these two position two frames. Move to left. Okay, not bad. So guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video, leave comments and have a good day. Good luck.